Hygienics is a CLIA and New York certified lab that has been at the forefront of Lyme disease and co-infection testing for 25 years, introducing many industry-leading tests, including multi-species western blots for Bartonella and immunal blots for Borreliosis. The immunal blot is the most advanced antibody test available for Lyme disease because it can detect multiple species of Lyme Borreliae and can detect infection at all stages of disease. So the Hygienix immunoblood test is better than standard serology tests, which tests for only one Borrelia species, while Hygienix immunoblood tests for eight different species of Borrelia across the world, resulting in a sensitivity of more than 93%. Hygienix offers tests for all the major tick-borne diseases and co-infections, including Bartonella, Babesia, Rickettsia, Anaplasma, and Ehrlichia. Here at Hygienix, we prefer the panel approach because it offers a combination of both indirect and direct testing, whereas if you're just doing an individual test, it might be only looking at antibodies or only looking at antigens, whereas with a panel approach, you're able to get the full spectrum of the disease. Additionally, we offer panels that combine borreliosis, so Lyme and tick-borne relapsing fever, and then we offer ones that uh, are just the co-infections, such as Babesia, Bartonella, Ehrlichia. Hygienix offers both RT-PCR and antibody tests for COVID-19. The company is currently providing testing for major employers, hospitals, schools, and governments all across the United States. We felt that with the knowledge and the teams we have at Hygienix, we can definitely offer testing for COVID-19. So we developed the test, RT-PCR test, and also the immunoblots. And what we found useful was we started testing it out in our own lab. Our protocol was to test everybody, measure the temperature in the beginning, and uh, see if they had any symptoms to go home. We decided at Hygienix, was to keep the number of testing not very high. Like we were not trying to do thousands of tests a day. What we were concentrating on was getting the result to the patient as quickly as possible and quality testing, no shortcuts. We absolutely made sure when we reported a result out that it was either positive or negative. If it was inconclusive, for example, we would retest it immediately before we release the results. 